What is going on, guys? My name is Ram back again from Ronnie Views here with another episode reaction to Azure Lane. Uh, this is going to be episode 9. Uh, first off, I'd like to apologize. I'm incredibly sick. I've been sick for the last couple days. Um, and it's just getting worse and worse. And um, it doesn't help the fact that I'm work at, I am work in a grocery store where all that just infe infestates uh, colds and just, just d diseases and germs just seems to uh, manifest uh, in an abundance in a grocery store. And the fact that I'm not really able to take, like, time off to relax is not helpful either. So, um, I'm pretty out of it right now. And, in fact, I'm going to be taking, uh, going to bed right after this. Uh, and, yeah, so, I do apologize if I, like, seem like I'm tearing up or if I'm, like, blowing my nose a lot or just sniffing. It's due to allergies and, top, and part of, like, the cold. Um, so, yeah, I'm not, like, really crying at the at the show i feel like um but a little bit of a recap of what, what happened last episode uh you could really tell that the animation quality has significantly uh, dropped in terms of the show and uh, which is unfortunate because it seems like this is a very very popular game and i'm i'm assuming that the developers probably didn't spend too much money into the production again i don't also don't know how much production of this anime costs or how much they were allotted <clears throat> and i know that they took a week uh break to basically just let the uh uh show just take a break and maybe look better but it hasn't really seemed that way i mean episode seven although i'll give it episode seven which was that giant battle was pretty good for the most part although last episode you could really tell that there was some uh, uh cuts in terms of the animation and the, it was it was a little jarring uh to see it because episode eight i would feel i would say it was the worst in terms of animation quality um, and the story does seem a little bit all over the place and i'm a little I i'm hoping that they start focusing more in like um, talking more about what's going on and figuring out what just what's happening uh, but yeah but anyways I'm ready to jump into this episode guys so without further ado let's jump in to episode 9 of Azure Lane starting in 3 2 1 let's jam <clears throat> Ayanami Alright, so it's a bit of a recap. Yeah, because she was about to fall into the void, but Leifi and Javelin was able to <clears throat> catch Ayanami before she actually fell in there. So she's back at Azure Lane. Because those are the same uh, rooms. Arc Royal? Yep. Although you would want to, Arc, huh, Arc Royal? That's to some of them. And intro. Called it. Alright. As per usual, I always mute the intro. Copyright. But yeah, alright, so. Ayanami is now a prisoner of war. I wonder who else. I think she, she'll be the only prisoner of war. Um, I don't really see any of the other ones got captured at all. Also, I do want to apologize for being late on this episode. It's normally a little bit later than when I do this, but I got off work later, which sucks though, because I was like, hey, I'm sick. Can I go home early? <laughs> no. <laughs> but I wasn't going to be an asshole and call out. But yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out what is going to progress with this. I mean, like I said, we do know that the sirens are playing. 
at least Akagi. Kaga is just going with how she is, with how she is, and I'm trying to figure out when how Iron Blood is going to connect to all this. There seems to be a, a lot of like plot variants, and they need to start focusing and like I'll wrap it up because, like I said, this is episode nine now. We don't have that many more episodes. We have like what four more episodes, and then we're done. So I feel like this is the episode to start like reeling it in, because like I said, I feel like the last two or three episodes should be them finding the sirens. All of them. So they need to get both Sakura Empire and Iron Blood in on it. So let's see what happens. Sorry. Just trying to turn up a little bit so you guys can hear something. Belfast is also still a great character. <laughs> it's not going to be really a punishment. That's a good, uh, that's a good, uh, anti-punishment punishment. punishment. Is that tea or coffee? That's tea. They're British. Damn Brits. Oh, okay, it's a mix. Okay. That's also a lot of sugar. Three sugars? Phew. It's because it's imbued its powers into Enterprise. Well, now. Yeah, where is she? Is she like resting again? Am I, are we gonna see? We're we gonna see her in her bed again. Oh, okay. So she's basically on like almost like a hospital ward. Ward, my in my opinion, or my guess. Well, I mean, honestly, anyone finding Enterprise would probably be a little bit terrified. You hear that Aurora da, Aurora da, and eh, dead, mostly. Okay, never mind. She's just out and about. I assumed she was gonna be like strapped up in a thing. <laughs> oh, by the way, the dub—it's—it's it's actually kind of appealing hearing all of the uh, different sh uh, ships. Have their own uh, accents. Only watched like half the first episode, but yeah, hearing all the British ships sound British. It was it was a bit good. I wonder if they give gave Enterprise her personality because of the general. What well, that was it, MacArthur? I forgot who was the general on the actual Enterprise um, during World War II, and I think he had a very similar. I wonder if he had a similar mindset, and that's what they derived Enterprise's emotions like. Phoenix? That looks like Phoenix. Oh, <laughs> that's kind of funny. Uh, oh, crap. I... Wait, was it Borg? I thought it was something else. Charles Osborne. Osborne.
justice. <laughs> Freaking Lafey. I know, I, I call him Lafey, even though Laffy Lafey. Eh. Also, by the way, Little Beavers, if you get them all limit bro broke up to a certain point, you get a... I forget what you get. You get something. I'll have to look into it again. I ha I haven't limit broke a lot of a lot of characters. I need to. I'm kind of focusing on a core majority before I focus on others. Arc. Of course, you would be where the, all the other little girls are. Arc Royal. <laughs> she shot. No, I'm not giving you my gems. I am not giving you my gems, Akashi. I don't care how cute you are. <laughs> it's, it's, it looks like Enterprise. And so did the price. Funnel cakes, hot dogs, donuts. Sorry, I thought I heard something. Left. She's being their shadow. You're not having any other uh, secondary opinions, huh? They're probably all assuming the worst. <laughs> oh yeah, totally. They're totally bullying her. I still need to get Yukikaze. Everyone else is all like down. She's trying to be the, uh... <coughs> She's trying to be like the anchor for the rest of them. <sighs> hey, Nagato. Kawakaze. I don't have Mutsu. I have Kawakaze. She just hasn't. I haven't really touched her though. She's just been sitting in my dock. That's what I was thinking. You can't say Ada to me. It's one of my. It's one of my weaknesses. <laughs> it's okay, Prince Wigan. Okay. War Spite also is best, is a great unit. After, like. <coughs> I 
I'm actually probably going to uh like when I get her up to the level I might oh thwar spite she's pretty damn cute. It is really weird seeing them out of their like normal attire. It's it, it was a it's a little hard to like recognize them. I mean, Queen Elizabeth is always noticeable with that freaking thing. It's called love. Therefore, Belfast, you need to ship yourself with her and steal her heart. Yeah, I meant steal but with two E's, but it actually works that way, too. <laughs> Is she the first one to, like, pick that out? I'm pretty sure Belfast at least would under could see that too, with how much he's spent time with her. But yeah. First time I've seen cars. No, I take that back. Stop saying Anna. <laughs> Who's driving? <laughs> I ship it. <laughs> Montpelier. Oh, Portland. Yay. I haven't seen... I, wait, is this the first time I've seen Portland? I don't think so. I mean, there's Ranger, Hamid. Oh, God, there's so many. I don't know those people. Sand, Sandy, Cold to Sandy. Anyone? I mean, Sure. I keep on forgetting illustrious is illustrious is or freaking huge. She's gonna have a lot of back problems. Just saying. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Ark Royal's in the background, if you're noticing. Hold on, I don't see her in this one. Ark Royal was always in the background just watching. Oh, isn't that Oh crap! What's her name? That's a um, Erebus. Something like that. Pancakes. <coughs> Sorry. Itadaki boss. Lafey, will you ever just fix your strap? I know now. If you think about it, this, it's just how it was in the first episode. <laughs> Careful, you're gonna make her cry, and it's gonna be chaos all over again. <laughs> okay, that's that's cute. That's cute. I'll give it that. That's cute. Is that? <laughs> I can't fucking do that. 
<laughs> God damn it, Ark Royal. <laughs> you fucking lollycon. <laughs> I knew there was an ulterior motive. <laughs> I'd fucking die. Japanese. No, it's not. Oh. Batch! Batch! Oh, I saw Batch! I never thought I would see Batch. Holy shit, I did not think I would see Batch. With my mouth. Oh my... <laughs> <laughs> you deserved an Ark Royale. Yes, if you don't know, Ark Royale is a little bit of a lollycon. She likes them young. Because she, she's a horrible person. <laughs> Back to the freaking Ration Mars Enterprise. That's not what you're supposed to do. Oh, back at the shrine. In thing. It's gonna be Kaga, isn't it? So now they're trying to use Kaga like they use a Kagi. And well, it's working. I have no idea how they're going to wrap this up. This is ending in what, 13 episode, right? I don't see it being progressed anytime soon. I don't think you're allowed to be walking around. Isn't Ark Royal supposed to like pop out right here? Oh, no, no, or Enterprise. A smiling Enterprise. Okay, but why though? Probably because she, like, was in the mindset of, like, just trained that way. To, like, hate Agilene. Because it doesn't say that uh, Ayanobi was originally part of Agilene. Or back when was around with, uh, when uh, Sakura Empire was still with Agilene. It doesn't, sh I, don't, I don't think it said that. So maybe that's all she knows, is was just told to hate Agilene. Hi, Unicorn. I mean, the Unicorn's around, I'm assuming. All three of them, okay. <coughs> Apologies. <coughs> I'm sorry. I hate being sick, I'm sorry. Wasn't this the spot they were originally at? Started from the beginning. That's that's cool. That's a good, that's a nice little touch. Are they gonna end the episode here? Okay. That okay. That, that okay. That, okay. Not gonna lie. That was a um uh. A good way to like end it 
uh, with this. Okay, so I kind of feel like that's going to wrap up, uh, like, Ayanami's whole shtick and uh, thing with Azure Lane. That's going to wrap it up. But it seems like I did say that I was hoping they were pushing towards the direction, and they are. I just kind of wish it was a little bit more um, focused. So it seems like the siren, the, <coughs> Jesus, the sirens is going, is uh, targeting Kaga now to get her on her, um, to get her on their side. Uh, first they started, they targeted Akagi, and now they're targeting Kaga. Um, they, uh, they were targeting Akagi because she wanted to see her sister again. And they're targeting Kaga because she wants to see her sister again. So it's just like, it's it's like a bit of a uh, cycle, I guess you could say. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to skip to the end. Oh, there's nothing going to be at the end. Uh, but yeah, I am curious as to see what's going to happen next and how they're going to uh, wrap this up. I hope they don't rush it too much uh, because there is a lot of stuff uh, I feel like they still should really be doing. Uh, but we'll see. We'll definitely see. And as also, I think I, know, I pointed this out before, um, Enterprise's uh, facial expressions have changed throughout the ending, uh, which is a nice little touch. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys were able to put up with my sick voice and uh, sniffles and coughs. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully, uh, for the continuation and the uh, finishing of the first season of uh, Buddy's, uh, Buddy Girls Up By. Um, Hopefully I'm a little bit better. Uh, uh, I, I do work tomorrow, but I get off really early, so we'll see what happens. And uh, if I can get some sleep in me, um, I'll go for a pair. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.